that we have to speak clearly, no matter how uncomfortable that may be. You only speak of green, eternal, economic growth, because you are too scared of being unpopular. You only talk about moving forward with the same bad ideas that got us into this mess, even when the only sensible thing to do is pull the emergency brake. You are not mature enough to tell it like it is. Even that burden you leave to us children. But I don't care about being popular. I care about climate justice and a living planet. Our civilization is being sacrificed for the opportunity of a very small number of people to continue making enormous amounts of money. Our biosphere is being sacrificed so that rich people in countries like mine can live in luxury. It is the suffering of the many which pay for the luxuries of the few. The year 2078, I will celebrate my 75th birthday. If I have children, maybe they will spend that day with me. Maybe they will ask me about you. Maybe they will ask why you didn't do anything while there still was time to act. You say you love your children above all else, and yet you are stealing their future in front of their very eyes. Until you start focusing on what needs to be done rather than it, what is politically possible, there is no hope. We cannot solve the crisis without treating it as a crisis. We need to keep the fossil fuels in the ground and we need to focus on equity. And if solutions within this system are so impossible to find, then maybe we should change the system itself. And if solutions within the system are so impossible to find, then maybe we should change the system itself. We have not come here to beg world leaders to care. You have ignored us in the past and you will ignore us again. You have run out of excuses and we are running. You have run out of excuses. 
excuses and we are run. We have run out of excuses and we are run. We have run out of excuses and we are run. We have run out of excuses and we are run. We have run out of excuses and we are run. We have run out of excuses and we are run. We have run out of excuses and we are run.
البشر كائنات تطفو عديمة الحياة في بلاد لا تعرف النور كل الأمور معقدة تلتهم العقول فنستيقظ مثل البارحة نفطر فشل ونمضي في محاولة أن نتذكر أيام المدرسة الأصدقاء قبل أن يعرفوا معنى الجشع والخجل من كل نظرة معبأة بسؤال ويأتي الغداء فنأكل نكد كم من الترهات في اليوم أسمعها أنا السكوت لا يعني الموافقة نعبر سويا ولا أحد يتذكر منا أحد كل يداهم الضجر فهو الأشد من الحزن أو الغضب حان العشاء والجيوب مثل جذوع النخيل فنأكل النوم ولا نحن ولا خليا عندما يصبح الاكتئاب رفاهية لا نملكها والعمل واجب والعبادة فرض والجنس تجارة والأموال ورق والإنسان عدم فما يبطل صيام الأمل نكره الموت لكننا كثيرين نعاس أما الألم فهو الدليل على بقائنا أصحى احذر عندما لا تشعر بالألم احذر عندما لا تشكو من علم ارضى بجسد عاجز ما دام الصبا على مقربة منك رائحة العسل إحساس الشجر ذهبت حرارة توت وبدأ الورق يتساقط كم كانت جميلة أيام الشباب ذهبت ولكن الجسد لا يشفى من الوسط يسيطر العقل على العمل فنبدأ من حيث ابتدينا يا للمعرفة البشر كائنات تطفو على الاستحالة عديمة الابتكار في بلد تغرق في الكسل كل المخلوقات نافقة ولا أحد مسؤول فهل يدوم هذا السواد فلا يختلف كثيرا اليوم غدا كل المخلوقات نافقة فلا أحد